Hello and welcome to the final lesson on the introductory to layers. So in this lesson, I just want to briefly emphasize something that we've talked about previously, and that is organizing your individual layers, either by naming the layers or by grouping them or both. So it doesn't matter if you're a graphic designer or a photographer. As you work on your projects, you're going to be adding more and more layers, and it just makes it so much easier for your workflow if you name your layers according to what that layer is all about, as well as categorizing or naming your grouped layers based on the contents within it. So here we have a web design project that is part of this course, and there are tons and tons of different types of layers within it. And as you can see, I've named them accordingly based on what that content is, as well as the grouped content. So I highly recommend getting into the habit of naming your layers based on what that particular layer is all about. If you're using adjustment layers to edit images, you want to name that layer based on what that adjustment layer is. So if we add an adjustment layer to this particular image here, and it's a levels one, I may want to rename that image six levels adjustment or something along those lines. That way I know if I need to find that particular layer, I can locate it with my search option up here via name or worst case scenario, I can search by the type of layer. So that is it on the introductory of layers. If you have any questions about layers, please post them in the Q&A section and I'd be happy to answer your questions as soon as possible. Thanks for listening and have an awesome day.